This is the BNT Mini Cordless Chopper. Let's take it out of the box. In the box you get an instruction booklet, a USB cable which is USB to micro USB. They give you a cleaning brush right here to help clean the unit out and of course the chopper itself. Now this comes apart into different pieces. First of all you press that button and as long as you press it it'll run the blades. Charge port is right in there and then that closes up. This comes off. This is the motor. This piece goes on which covers the container and here are the blades and you can see there are four blades so it's actually going to do a really nice job chopping. So we just stick everything back in there and put it all together. I have some garlic I'm going to chop up, but I want to tell you a little bit more about the unit before I do that. The container is 250 milliliters, which is 8 ounces or 1 cup. Yep, it's small. Great for garlic, ginger, uh, stuff like that, that you would chop up for a lot of different meals, garlic especially here, which is what I'm going to be doing today. It has a 1500 milliamp hour battery, charges in three hours, and it can be used up to 50 times once that battery has been charged. The plastic on it is also BPA free, so you don't have to worry about any kind of chemicals leaching out of that and into the food, so it is safe to use in that regard. It is not dishwasher safe, it needs to be hand washed, but this is a tiny item anyway, so it's really not that big of a deal. Now, who would want this, and why would you want to use this? Well, it's small, easy to store if you're in an apartment, uh, like a studio apartment especially, but you want an electric chopper, this will do the trick for you. And um, this way it won't take up a lot of room. You can put it just about anywhere. Uh, it's not much bigger around than a coffee mug, really. So, all around, it's a nice small size. Maybe you have one of those tiny homes would be great for that. Uh, or if you're living off-grid but you have maybe solar panels to charge things. Well, that would also be an excellent uh, use case for this. Uh, a lot of times, maybe even, even if you have a regular house, maybe a spouse has uh, passed on or something like that and you're only cooking for one person, that's really all you need right there. So now let's go ahead and use it. Okay, so the first thing I wanted to show you is when you have all of the pieces assembled correctly and you put the top on, the light is going to blink. And that lets you know you have everything connected there. So I have some garlic here, so we'll take the top off. We'll take that piece off, and now I'm going to put the garlic in. It has a nice rubbery base on it like that, so that way it's not going to skitter around on the uh, counter. And then you have to put the top back on. Now, it has to fit in. You see, it can go, you know, but it fits in. There's grooves where it fits. And once you do that, then you put the top on. And again, there's a groove where that fits. Once I do that, the light there will flash on top. I don't think you can see that, but you saw it before. And now we're going to go ahead and chop. I am going to let this run until no more garlic pieces are flying around inside. You can chop to whatever consistency you want. In fact, I'll do that just for a moment. You can see already how we've already chopped up that garlic, but I'm going to let this go because I want it very, very finely minced. That's looking very good. I'm going to let that go for a bit longer. Uh, 
I like my garlic basically pulverized into a paste. Put these items aside for just a moment. I'll take the blade out. Yep, that works. That's perfect right there for me. Perfect to go into a frying pan with some oil and then cook up whatever you're going to be cooking up. So it did a great job all around. So here are the results right here, which is exactly what I like. Yes, you can do this with a knife. But, you know, depends how long you want to sit there and do it. If you have a little gadget like this that can do it, hey, that's great. Also great for RVs, campers, stuff like that. You know, where you have small space constraints and power constraints as well. Uh, you can still whip up some really nice meals. So all around a decent mini chopper that is cordless from BNT. If you'd like to purchase this item... I'll leave a link in the video description where you can find the item available for sale on Amazon. Thanks for watching. Make sure you click like, make sure you click subscribe, and take care. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.